Fibre Systems TV at Angercom and I'm joined at the VRV Solutions booth with Doug Clegg, Solutions Marketing Manager, who is talking to us today about how fibre is a key and integral part of future network upgrades and evolutions, resulting in technicians being required to deal more with fibre and new technologies than ever before. Doug, can you please tell us a bit more about how VRV helps operators combat these challenges? Yes, certainly. So it's true that fibre is being utilised more and more in all kinds of network deployments. Um, you know, whether it's wireline um, FTTH or, you know, HFC for cable or, uh, you know, fibre in access. So, uh, or even in, you know, wireless um, for 5G. So there's a lot of uh, things that need to happen around um, fibre testing in order to, to make the life for the tech um, a little easier, basically. And sometimes it's because, um, you know, making their life uh, easier is, is because maybe they're not so experienced with the equipment. Maybe it's new equipment to them, for example, um, you know, an, an HFC cable tech doing, um, or a, an access cable, uh, um, telco cable uh, technician uh, doing, is being asked to do fibre tests. So, you know, they may not have had the experience with that in the past. So, you know, the equipment they're testing is new. So, in order to try and help them, uh, we're trying to make our equipment as easy, you know, as possible to use, to set up and use. So, we, uh, you know, we, we put a lot of time and effort into uh, uh, putting intelligence into the equipment so that it can go ahead and automatically learn the type of network that it's testing, the fibre link that it's testing, for example, and uh, and have the, uh, the the technician, yeah, not really have to bother too much with with all the setup details. So um, once we've actually done some testing, the next tricky part, of course, is to actually try and you know interpret results. So again, you know, we try to help the technician there by doing things like taking a, a, an OTDR trace, for example, uh, and using our smart link mapper application, you know, we convert that into a nice, easy to read um, icon you know, view. So we're really trying to take the, um, the, the, the hassle, let's say, of actually setting up and using the equipment away um, by you know, having either set itself up or by using predefined configurations, or, uh, and then by interpreting results by having them, you know, uh, having it in a more simplified uh, kind of a view. And obviously, certification is a top topic in fibre at the moment. How do you guys help with this topic? Yeah, so, yeah, certification is key, absolutely. You want to know that, um, you know, that your techs and your contractors out there doing the work um, are doing it correctly and doing it to the right kind of standards and specs. So um, there's, there's two parts to it, I think. One is, is again, trying to help the technicians with the, 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 the test process itself. So again, you know, we've been developing applications to simplify that yeah. and to do guided test flow. So simple, you know, guided steps one, two, three, four that take them through setting up a test, running it, storing the results, and then on to the next test. Right. So, uh, but beyond that, then there's a bigger picture of workflow. So, and that's more to do with the, you know, the end-to-end -end project management. Right. So again, we provide solutions that will enable service providers um, to manage both techs and contractors alike you know, to set up projects, to define tasks, you know, tests basically to run, to allocate them. Once the tests are run in the instrument, that can be uploaded to the cloud and, um, you know, it's instantly available for people to run reports to see, you know, how their, their, their project is going. And obviously, remote fire has now come to the cable world, which brings with it many new challenges. What's VR these thoughts on the certification and testing requirements for this one? So, yeah, remote fire is an interesting one because it's going to cover a wide range of um, of technologies and, and tests basically so there's going to be a traditional you know RF and DOCSIS test element to it there's going to be a you know analog fibers or fibers that we're doing you know analog services are now going to become essentially digital fibers running Ethernet and that's going to be using you know technologies like DWDM for example so people are going to have to start using um, you know DWDM OTDRs for example to certify fibers you know are ready for the for the for the uh, the services um, the Ethernet testing side of things, there's going to be a, a timing is going to be particularly important because um, just to avoid uh, clashes, basically, uh, uh, with the uh, timing of um, far end devices, CPE devices, for example, um, causing data um, uh, losses and errors. So, um, so yeah, it's going to be an interesting. One, it's going to be a mix of all of these things um, uh, together. Is there anything else you'd like to end on today? Um, yeah. So, well, ultimately, um, you know, new technology deployments. Uh, bring new challenges, right? And um, so, you know, Viavi is putting uh, a lot of our, you know, uh, years of expertise basically into, um, you know, solving these 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 problems. You know, we we pull um, 
uh, specialists and information and knowledge from, from all aspects of the company, all, 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 all areas, in order to um, you know, pretty much cover the entire network life cycle for customers. And we work closely with those customers in order to determine you know, not just you know, a test, but you know, what is actually best to test, what's the best practical thing to do. So, um, yeah, so we bring all that, that knowledge and experience we have you know, we, we liaise and work with customers in order to figure out what's, what's best to do, but yeah, ultimately to help, you know, do, meet those challenges. Sounds like a very exciting time for VRB. Thank you very much. Thank you.